We just got finished building a catch pen for our painted desert sheep today. As you can see, it works. So anytime I need to medicate them, I can get them in here, warm them, whatever. That'll be nice. But we're probably going to make another smaller section in here, you know, so we can catch them and, you know, trim their hooves or whatever we need to do. But this is good for now. Before we were trying to catch them in this big field and you had to use like a four-wheeler <laughs> to corral them, which was really a pain. But this will be good. Anyway, that's it. It's nothing fancy, but it'll do for now. Alright, time to let the sheep out. Tag, are you ready to go in with the sheep? These are livestock guardian dog, Great Pyrenees. He's a very good dog. Yep, keep them coyotes away. Right, buddy. Alright. Get the sheep. This breed's pretty flighty. I have one ram who's super sweet and wants pets, and then the other ones don't want anything to do with me. So, I think that's generally the way that they are. What is happening? Long shot, you okay, buddy? What is that? He might have a piece of grass or something stuck in his nose. Not sure what's going on there. I gotta get a new latch for this gate. We just wired it together, so. Yeah, there we go. Alright. Okay. Come on, guys. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Come on, guys. You're free. You're free. Come on, Gypsy. Yeah, there's my big boy. He just wants some pets. He's a good boy. Mm-hmm. Long shot, you smile. All right, one figured it out. That's their first time ever being in here. Come on. <laughs> this is our pregnant you. Her name's Esmeralda. This is her first lambing. So. <coughs> what you see out there, Kagar? Hmm? What you see? <laughs> this little ram we're keeping, so it's important to have a new enclosure. But he's really cute. We named him Roman. 